The payment methods screen is how you can uh, set up which payment methods you want to be using on your card. So in most cases this is going to involve a payment gateway, this might be something like PayPal or Google Checkout or one of the payment gateways from the banks for example, or something like, I don't know, SagePay, AuthorizeNet or any of the other ones which Roaming Cards support. You can see the list of payment gateways that we do support by clicking on this uh, drop down box here and uh, you need to make sure that the payment gateway you want to use is in that list. So let's just add, for example, uh, PayPal Standard, if we select that there, and then click on Add New Method. You'll see that PayPal Standard is shown there underneath check in this case, uh, and there's some, uh, there's some icons there too. So the, the first thing you want to do is click on the Configure icon, uh, because your PayPal account needs to be set up, and each um, payment method has, has got some different instructions on what you need to do to set up that payment method so that it works with, with Roman Cart. In this case, this is PayPal Standard. Uh, you need to enter your primary PayPal email address there. There's some other options there, and there's some instructions below as well. Uh, step by step, it says, you know, log on to your PayPal account and complete the following steps. So you need to go through all these uh, and just do exactly what it says, point by point, uh, and you shouldn't have any problems. So uh, moving on down here, uh, the button image on the on the checkout page, uh, a standard, uh, just a simple grey button is displayed. You know, the standard sort of form button is displayed uh, with some standard text on it. It might say something like, click here to pay using PayPal. Uh, if you want to, uh, well, the first thing, actually, if you want to change the text on the button, you can do that using the translate screen. But um, if you if you want to actually show an image instead of the uh, instead of that button, uh, you can enter the URL in this box here for the actual image. Uh, remember, it's got to be a secure image, so in other words, it needs to be stored on SSL web space, and it must start HTTPS, uh, not HTTP. Uh, and you just put the URL in there of your uh, uh, of your secure image, and that would appear on the checkout page instead of the of the standard form button. Underneath here we've got the HTML for connecting page. Now with most of these payment gateways, um, you'll see the button will appear on the checkout page and then when the customer clicks on it, you'll see a page flash up for a few seconds which says, you know, in this case, please wait contacting PayPal. Now you can change this, uh, the screen and, and have it say what you like uh, using that box there. And then finally, we've got the uh, we've got the, the the region assignments for for this particular payment method. So in this case, this payment method is available to customers in any location. If you want to restrict uh, a payment method to only be available in certain locations, you select that uh, radio button there, click on the the locations link there, and you can tick the boxes of where you want to uh, of where you want to to allow that. So you know we could have down here. Uh, select European countries, for example. Click on go. It'll select all the European countries, and then when you've done that, you want to click on save. And then on this main screen here, you want to click on Save Changes as well. So just click on back here and we we'll go back to this. Um, now, one other thing you can do here, like I mentioned before, we've got Check there, we've got PayPal Standard there. You might want to change the order of the payment buttons on the checkout page. So uh, if we want to move PayPal Standard to the top in the Order column, we just click on the up arrow there and that moves PayPal Standard to the top. Uh, you can deactivate um, payment methods as well. Uh, there's a tick icon there. If we want to switch off check, for example, you just click on that tick icon and it changes to like a no entry uh, sign. Uh, the region icon there as well, uh, as I showed you a few seconds ago, um, the, the PayPal standard, for example, is, is set up to accept uh, to be used in all regions. Uh, if you restrict the regions, then you'll see a different icon there. This at the moment it's a globe. Uh, you see a kind of restricted globe icon there to show that it's limited uh, to, to not all countries. Uh, and then finally, uh, you can delete a payment method by clicking on the trash can icon on the right.